Thank you. Further debate? Seeing none, I return to the member who has two minutes to reply plus the time on the clock. Thank you. Thank you, Madam Speaker. And thank you, the Minister Cho and MPP Sandon and the uh, MPP Pound for your confidence in Bill 34 and for your support. Thank you as well uh, to member from University Rosedale and the member from Spadana Fort York for your valuable input. Speaker, this year makes the 50th anniversary in, Can in Canada for multiculturalism as an official policy. May is Asian Heritage Month. May is also Mental Health Awareness Month across Canada, which makes this the perfect time and ideal social climate to have introduced Bill 34, Anti-Asian Racism Education Month in May. Speaker, I strongly believe that Bill 34 will encourage open communication on the sensitive topic of racism. It will help to educate the public about anti-Asian racism, hatred, and discrimination, and will positive impact on the public perceptions of their Asian Canadian neighbors. Speaker, Bill 34 will also help to foster a deeper sense of belonging in Canada among Asian youths and their families, as well as including the revealed elders in, a in Asian communities. Speaker, with collective courage and the determination, Bill 34 gave us the prime opportunity to raise public awareness about the reality of anti-Asian racism and how it impacts each of us and our community. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Thank you. The time provided for a private member's public business has expired. Mr. Kea has moved second reading of Bill 34, an act to proclaim May as Anti-Asian Racism Education Month. Is it the pleasure of the House that the motion carry? Carried. Carried. Second reading of the bill, does it make sure to push it to law? Which committee? Uh, sent to Standing Com Committee on Regulation and Private Bills. Thank you. Is the majority in favor of the bill being referred to the Standing Committee on Regulation and Private Bills? Agreed. 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 Okay. All matters relating to private members' public business having been completed, this House stands adjourned until Monday, December 6th at 10.15 a.m.